This video is part of a course that you can find in my Ultimate Game Development Academy along with 17 other courses where you can learn how to make games using Unity, Unreal Engine, Gada Engine, and GameMaker. Plus, you will also learn how to create your own 2D and 3D assets using Blender and Krita. You can enroll in my Ultimate Game Development Academy with a monthly and a yearly payment. That is, or a yearly payment. And currently, I'm running a promotion where if you enroll with a yearly payment, you get four and a half months for free. That's right, four and a half months, not five, but four and a half. So yeah, click the link below and join in the yearly promotion or in the yearly subscription and get four and a half months for free. What is up guys and welcome to our C++ tutorial series where we will learn how to use C++ for the sake of the programming language and as well for Unreal Engine. Now before we start doing that we're going to download our IDEs or integrate in development environments. We're going to work with Visual Studio or Visual Studio Code so your preference. I'm going to use Visual Studio but I'm going to show you how to download both and I'm going to show you what's important so what is important for you to download in order to make Visual Studio and Visual Studio Code work with Unreal Engine when we start coding things later in Unreal Engine. So going on Google, which is your best friend, just type download Visual Studio and you will see this link. So if I go back over here, this is that link. So I'm going to click on that link. It's going to take me right over here. So you are going to download, of course, the community one, which is the free version. So click here, free download. And also for the Visual Studio code, click here, free download. If you're on Mac and you also want to download Xcode, because I believe Unreal Engine will not even open in a C++ project if you don't, if you don't download Xcode. So you can go on your app store for the Mac and download Xcode. So simply type Xcode and download it. It's very simple. So then in your downloads, when you download these, you're going to open them. So first of all, open this visual community. So this one is for visual, so visual studio community, click on that. And here you will see what is available for you to download. I personally am going to use the visual studio community 2017. So you're going to click on download, but what's really important here, when you click it to download it, you will see something like this. So here is that important part that I'm going to tell you to download in order to make all of this work, okay? So what you need to check here is the development. So I checked this development with C++, that is the desktop development. I also checked this one for Unity, but you will not need that for Unreal Engine, but I used it. But here is the really important part. So game development with C++, so make sure that that is checked make sure that that is checked okay so yeah that one needs to be checked i also checked this one i'm not one i'm not 100 sure if this one is a really really a requirement but just to be safe because i had a lot of issues making this work with unreal engine but basically when i downloaded a lot of these components such as these here that you see so all of these here, I checked all of these not sure if i need every individual of these but i still downloaded them so after I downloaded all of these, then my Unreal Engine started to work with Visual Studio and blah, blah, blah. So there were probably some, there will probably be some of you wise guys who'll be like, technically you don't need to download this, I don't care. So I'm telling you what to download. If you don't need something, don't download it and then have issues with getting Visual Studio to work with Unreal Engine, okay? So yeah, when you select all of that, then you're going to download, you're going to click here, install while downloading, blah, 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 and all of the good stuff in here. You're going to click install to install and download Visual Studio Community. You can also use 2019. Currently I'm using 2017. I don't care, I'm savage, okay? So this is for your Visual Studio. For the Visual Studio code, after you download Visual Studio, click here to run and next, 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 you, you know the drill, next, blah, 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 and install that bad boy as well. So that is everything you need to know when it comes to installing these things. And uh, yeah, we will also see later how we can install Unreal Engine, so don't worry about that. But this is what is important for you to check all of those things that I just talked about. Go pause the video, rewind it back, so that when you start working with Visual Studio and program in C++ for Unreal Engine, you will not have any issues, okay? So yeah, thank you very much, and uh, I will see you in another video. This video is part of a course that you can find in my Ultimate Game Development Academy along with 17 other courses where you can learn how to make games using Unity, 
Unreal Engine, Gada Engine, and GameMaker. Plus, you will also learn how to create your own 2D and 3D assets using Blender and Krita. You can enroll in my Ultimate Game Development Academy with a monthly and a yearly payment. That is, or a yearly payment. And currently, I'm running a promotion where if you enroll with a yearly payment, you get four and a half months for free. That's right, four and a half months, not five, but four and a half. So yeah, click the link below and join in the yearly promotion or in the yearly subscription and get four and a half months for free.